EFCC will not be attending the widow's wedding. Let me explain. Because of how EFCC have been arresting people because of Naira abuse, especially in the recent days. We also what happened to Bobriski and Kobana Chifris. Bobriski is still out there. So EFCC have been attending party looking for people who abused the Naira, spraying Naira. In the case of the widow, EFCC will not be going. Not that they did not invite them or they told them not to come. No, it's because the guests that will be going to the widow's wedding, they're not going to spray Naira. They've all be arranging their dollar. So I don't think EFCC have anything to do with dollar. So EFCC will not be attending the widow's wedding. Remember, the widow's wedding is strictly by invitation. If you don't get invitation, I beg you, it's better you stay away from that location because I hear the security where they go there, they know they see their face. Now, those ones where they cover our face, you know, and they are very giant and they'll not send your papa. So if you don't get invited, I beg you in the name of whatever you fear, stay away from that place. I'm not saying this one of my business, but I said, let me can ask, where that girl we been talked that time seeing gay belay for the widow? We was everywhere. She never born. I guess it was a fake pregnancy. Anyway, glory be to God. She did not succeed in destroying the widow's marriage. At least the marriage is going to hold. So the moral lesson of this, what God have joined together, let no man put us under or else we'll be thrown under. Hey, almost a punchline. Anyway, congratulations to the widow and Choma. May their marriage last. Other people, the feast wedding weekend, the widow go putting on for weekday. As soon as they walk, we can distract to now with him wedding. Anyway, I have nothing else to tell you, but enjoy your weekend. Thank you.